all right so we're gonna jump into the video in just a moment but I just wanted to let you guys know that this is a video that's composed of older footage um, so I still have my wheels on the car and I think it's right after the trip to Georgia so um, that, that'll be referencing that um, I'm gonna record a couple new clips too because I know I talked about a few things in there that I didn't go back and do like the new sticker so I'm gonna go ahead and show that in another clip right after so so yeah so that'll be all of that but I also want to let you guys know that as of today um, my wife's website is officially up for her business she's selling uh, artwork as well as functional pieces um, like coasters wine butlers um, some, some game pieces uh, it's just a lot of stuff she's selling so I'll put a link in the description below make sure you get um, your merch or your stuff from her uh, because she is making everything one-to-one -one. Um, she might be able to recreate in terms of colors but just the layout and all of that is gonna be one of one each time so definitely make sure you go ahead and hit up her website uh, a link will be in the description down below and yeah let's go ahead and jump into the video what's up fitted squad this is Brad aka 2 fitted coming to you with another quick video and today I'm not even sure exactly what everything is going to be going on. Um, I'm going to get my oil change at Nissan. Um, haven't had it done in a while. Um, I made the trip to Georgia and back, but then Jacksonville, Florida and back. Um, and there's a lot before then, but I'm just about to hit 40,000 miles, so I'm gonna head on to do that. Um, also, I'm going to be putting some new decals on the car. I know that. Um, I think I'm gonna take off one and I'm gonna add, well, I'm gonna redo one, um, a different color. And then I'm gonna put that handprint back on the car as well. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure exactly what else I'm gonna be doing in this video, but stay tuned. So, um, this will be the sticker I'm redoing here. Um, when I first put it on, it was messed up. I messed it up putting it on. And that's been two years, I think, maybe almost three. So I'm gonna redo that one. Um, gonna put the handprint back there again and I'm going to make something for this spot there um, I'm not gonna go too overboard with the stickers like last time probably gonna just have those for now um, I may end up doing some more back here eventually um, I still need to get um, LTMR, support the homie, uh, Kia, Mr. Rockoff Johnson, make sure you follow him on Instagram and YouTube. Um, I need to get a new Matt Parker Stay Tuned, MPS3 as well. I'm probably going to do Boost Emotion, NordTM, um, Enthusiast POV, I might do those as well if they have stickers I can get. Um, support the homies and everything, but um, yeah, that's probably gonna be it. And I still need to put my roof spoiler back on. Still haven't wrapped it yet. Just been real lazy. But yeah, let's go ahead and head on to Nissan. All right, so here are the newer stickers. Um, Battle Gang's not new, but the CBT Villains. Um, this is kind of one I was referring to. I did add Street Elegance, uh, Division Seven, LTMR. Speed Zone, of course, has been there. I'm not sure if in that footage I had B Red Visions or not, but that's on there now. And of course, I did add the hand, like I said. But, and Speed Culture Studios, and of course, my two fitted. So, that's the update on the stickers there. Alright, so it seems like we got a, a bunch of newer people here. Um, a lot of people I don't recognize. There's nothing too bad about it, but as um, soon as I got in, it was like, oh, I don't know if we can get it up on the rack for the oil change. And I'm like, I've got my oil change here every time since I've had the car. And every time except for the first time, it's been lowered. And I believe I'm on my eighth oil change with them. So shouldn't be a problem. It hasn't been so far, but we'll see. All right, so seeing these, the new Rogue, that will be the color, but um, uh, yeah, let's take a look at it actually. 
I like the color of these wheels. What trim is this? Wow, it's just an S. And it's 27.4. 2021. Yeah, sitting under these trees is no joke. Always super dusty. And this one is the SV, and it's 29. But let's see. Those Titans look pretty cool. Huh. It's interesting. I wonder what's up with this here. Everything taken out of this one. SR, all wheel drive. Huh. They got the old fifth gen back here, too. So I'm wondering what, what these vehicles are. Got the dubs on this one. I think these might be employees' cars. Those ones lined up. Got a 300 ZX over there. Hiding. Let's go take a look at that. I'm just chilling up there. Yeah, these are employees' cars. I don't want to get too much into it, but um, looks cool. But that does look pretty clean. I probably would go with some different wheels, but I mean, I, I like them though. They're all right. But yeah, I hadn't seen the new Rogue. Um, I was used to seeing these. And then, which, which one is this? I think this is the Rogue Sport. Yep. It's the Rogue Sport. So we got the Sport, the regular one, and then the 2021 over here. Man, we need to get Jose back over here because uh, he would have this thing lifted and some aftermarket wheels. But that's still dope. But I know he would definitely do something special with this one. Looks good though. But yeah, that's pretty much going to do it for this video. Uh, I'd like to thank you all for tuning in. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe, and as always, stay fit. Peace.